Ever since Naruto Storm 2's inclusion of the guest characters Lars Anderson from the Tekken series, fans have been awaiting to see the face of a new challenger for the Storm series. Today I'm going to discuss some of the top guest characters from publisher Bandai Namco that I want included on the Storm 4 roster. <laughs> Alright, so I've gathered my top three characters that I want as guest stars in Naruto Storm 4. Considering it's next gen, it's really not really a push. And I think that they should really do some more collaboration with games because it promote it's promoting other games and different other games. Like we got the Goku costume in Naruto Storm 3. And they put the Sage Naruto costume in Battle of Z. So, I mean, it's good collaboration between uh game so i'm just gonna give you my top three so the first character that i would want to see as a guest star in naruto storm 4 would be kirito from sword art online i mean my my man kirito is a fool he would be perfect for the roster i mean he has a dual sword uh sword characters in naruto are always awesome to play as and we really don't have do we have a dual sword character that's playable I don't think so because we only have like single-handed sword users so I think that Kirito would make a great addition to the game and his combos would just be sick what the fuck is this what up nigga who is who are you a nigga Edo Oreo oh shit okay we got my ninja Edo Oreo in here youtube.com slash Edo Oreo go check him out link in the description link everywhere link in the video so you want in in this discussion? Oh yeah. All right, bro. Uh, why don't you give me your top character? Well, we're gonna go through the top three, but you can give me your top for right now. All right, my top character that I want to see would have to be Goku. Since they put the Naruto costume and all that, and I believe it was Battle of Z, then I feel like they should at least you know put Goku or you know more of dragon ball z incorporated in the naruto it'll be a fresh something fresh for it and i just feel like it'll make Man, it you a generic fun. ass nigga <laughs> yo chill look wow. i put i was gonna put my number two as a dvd character but you went ahead and just right? put that nigga right, on yo, yo, let one. me switch it up let me switch it up on you hold up but if they did put goku in the game i mean you could keep that as your number one but if they did put goku oh, in the game they're gonna have to uh tone him down to equal like a power level on par with the uh the naruto characters and they'll have to like limit him with flight abilities because that should be op scratch go to scratch that idea who i want to see i want to see luffy like when have we ever seen a successful fighting one piece game i really want to see luffy i want to see what they can do with him you know as combo wise and bringing him into a whole new world so i feel like luffy would be a great addition just a cameo character all right cool with me all right my number two character that i would want on the storm for a roster as a guest star would be v mon from digimon yep i said it anybody can catch this v knockout anytime any place like Can't i just had a guru my nigga no nah, i mean like, but you gotta think about it if you're gonna put a digimon in the game it has to be like someone who's like a fighter. You can't just have some dinosaur or dog looking Digimon in there. Like that's just gonna be weird as fuck. Like that kind of reminded me of when Clash of Ninja 2 when Akamaru was a playable character. That shit was just weird as fuck. So I think b -Mon would definitely have the combos to be in his game. And his true awakening could be like a Digi evolution. Like Digimon would actually fit perfect in the game as long as it's the right one so with that oreo what's your second character oh uh, call me corny but i kind of want to see lars again i mean in storm 2 he was pretty cool i guess and it didn't make much sense that they made him have like this shuriken machine gun but i kind of miss it i kind of miss that whole storm 2 feel so i feel like if he's in there you know it just take me back to, you know when storm was uh some foo-foo ass shit <laughs> and niggas played cheap but I really want to see Lars. I want to see some more costumes for him. Just have him in there. Oh, yeah, true. Lars was a savage in Storm 2. I mean, I wish they could have just brought him over to Revolution. But I know companies got to work out contracts and shit like that. So, 
Really don't know if he was going to be in there. Yeah, they didn't want them problems. Lars had them. Like, just imagine doing, like, revolution combos. Because you can get some, like, in Storm 2, you could barely get full combos off. And revolution, it would be so sick. Just I'd rather have it going. Yeah, if he was in Storm 3, that would have been GOAT. The combos with him would have been just finessing the online world. The ultimate Jutsu cancels, like, anything. That would be awesome. All right, so my third character, generic as fuck. I would want the Prince of All Saiyans, Vegeta. He would just be, I mean, I'm not really a Goku type person. The only Goku I fucks with is Super Saiyan 4 Goku, but that's kind of OP. But if I had to choose another one, it would be uh, Vegeta. Because he's nuts. <laughs> this nigga hating, but Vegeta just uh, always been one of my favorite Dragon Ball characters before Goku. And I think that if they're going to put goku in the game they might as well put vegeta and also another thought came to my head if they don't really put the uh the characters in the game you could give them vegeta's armor like the blue vegeta armor and then you get the goku uh gi like from the previous storm game so yeah vegeta would be a cool little addition mm, yeah i might uh, just put goku for my third pick just because you want to you gonna call me out in the vet and shit all right, so this man puts Goku as his third pick, so kind of be an equal out between if they put Goku and Vegeta in the game, cause they're both really overpowered. So well, for yeah. us, they put Goku, they're not gonna put Vegeta. We all know this. They're only gonna put like the main main character, the protagonist. That is true, but when the new movie comes out, we never know what could happen. They could throw fucking Frieza in that bitch. Sure. But the new gold form, even though that shit looks ugly as fuck to me, personally, that's just me. Nigga look like a chicken nugget, bro. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I was like why the oh, fuck shit. I'm getting hungry watching this shit? Holy shit. All right, guys. Well, that was the end of our discussion. Tell me some guest characters that you would want to star in the Storm 4 roster. Down below, they have to be Bandai Namco affiliated published games because it's really highly unlikely that they would get characters from different publishers to actually come over because if you know Tekken's published by uh, Bandai Namco Games so uh, that shit. leave down in the comments your top three guest characters that you want in the game uh you got any words to say yeah go to my channel look at it you see that subscribe button click that shit go to my vid you see that like button click that shit comment all that this nigga don't even upload. Don't fuck with that nigga. <laughs>